the breakdown of my Atlas Engine entry. Like most people, I brainstormed some ideas first. For example, I looked up some weird car designs. My next idea was to make a chariot with maybe a steampunk styled mech horse. But since I don't have the modeling and animation skills, I quickly abandoned the idea. Since I had some experience with modeling houses, my next idea was to combine the house aspect with the vehicles and look up houseboats on Pinterest. Which is when I stumbled upon the Dutch artist Jeroen van Kestel, who made these really nice airship designs out of paper. I immediately fell in love with them and took this one as my main inspiration. Next up, I collected some ideas for the environment. My first idea was to make a landscape out of clouds and have whales swimming the bird. That. But then I thought it would maybe be too boring and I had the idea of making a storm instead. Finally, I decided to combine the ideas to start at the storm and have a lighthouse guide the airship out on the peaceful cloud landscape. Before the end of the first week, I made a small block out for my scene. The second week, I mainly spent modeling the airship and later the environment. At the beginning of the third week, I put in some temporary textures and did my first cycles render. My biggest struggle by far was the animation, since I've never rigged a character before. With a lot of struggle, I managed to set up this IK rig which is a bit janky, but if you view at it from the right angle, it looks fine. The last week I spent fine-tuning the environment. For example, making a lightning for the storm, or a smoke simulation for the break through the clouds. For the lightning, I followed a tutorial by Bad Normals. He explained in great detail how to set up this expensive node tree, which I could have never done myself. And in the end, I basically have these three inputs that I can change. One is for the start animation. One is for the outgoing animation. And with the last one, I can randomize the lightning so that I have infinite variations. For the break through the clouds, I just did a simple smoke animation with the box as the domain and the airship as a collision object to pull the smoke out. Finally, I ran out of the mist pass to add some depth to the video, and then did some color correction in the rich resolve, and added some PNG clouds and rain to the storm.